Hi, my name is Ori Shavit and I'm a food writer for many years. I used to uh, learn uh, how to cook and uh, how to make pastry professionally and then I was writing for the best uh, gastronomic magazine in Israel and I was eating everything uh, until six years ago uh, but then I went on a date with a guy that changed my life. Uh, he was telling me a lot of information about my food that I never knew uh, about the animals in the livestock industry, about how my food affects my health and about how my choices affect the environment and I decided to make a great change, a huge change and to become 100% vegan. Since I went vegan I had to change my whole life because there was nothing vegan in Israel. Israel used to be a vegan desert back then and uh, I opened up my food blog, Vegans on Top, and I started writing recipes and collaborating with chefs, adding vegan dishes to the restaurants. I teach vegan cooking classes. I uh, help people make the change and uh, take people for tours to find out the amazing vegan food we have in Israel today. In six years, there's been a huge revolution in Israel from being that vegan desert to becoming a vegan heaven. Where you Veganism is so popular in Israel that, that it became the number one vegan country in the world with 5% vegans in the population and 40% of the people uh, declare that they have reduced the consumption of animal products. And this is for few reasons that are a combination of reasons. One is because we are a nation of immigrants and people came from all over the world and brought their culture and cuisine here. So our local cuisine is still evolving and people are used to innovations and trying new things and we have a Mediterranean diet which is perfect for vegans we have hummus and falafel of course but a lot of vegetables and grains and lentils and fruit whatever vegan eats and also the fact that we are a very small country with only 8 million people and when when things uh, catch up in Israel it's usually like fire everybody hears, hears about it everybody talks about it and uh, with social media it's just obvious that uh, you cannot avoid veganism anymore